In back to the nation's capital, poor research funding has been identified as the reason Nigerians in the intellectual community don't win the Nobel laureate prizes. The Committee of Vice Chancellors of Nigerian Universities said this while reacting to the announcement of the 2023 Nobel laureate winners in Abuja. Helen Osamide Ekins has the details. The Nobel Prize is an international prize awarded annually since 1901 for achievement in physics, chemistry, psychology or medicine, literature and peace. Nobel Prizes have been awarded to over 800 individuals since inception. Wallace Winka, a Nigerian, became the first African to win the world's most sought after literary prize. Since then, no Nigerian has attained that feat, and this, the Secretary General of the Committee of Vice Chancellors, ascribed to poor research funding. The benchmark is at least 1% of your GDP should be set aside for research and innovation. We are not even doing 0.01%. So that translates, so if you don't have the facilities to do the type of cutting edge research over a sustained period of time to compete with researchers from other parts of the world, you know, and make the type of significant breakthroughs that qualify you for a Nobel Prize nomination, not to talk of winning, you now see why Nigerians and Africans hardly feature when the list of Nobel Prize is released. Committee of Vice Chancellors of Nigerian Universities comprises of Vice Chancellors of Federal, State and Private Universities in Nigeria. They oversee the day to day activities of the institutions and maintain good relations with the principal officers and the various organs of the universities. It is set to commemorate its 60th and 61st year of existence with several activities on the 9th of October. It's a three in one celebration. Uh, three in one in the sense that we are going to celebrate our Diamond Jubilee, which actually was supposed to have been celebrated last year when we actually turned 60. Uh, but because of the prolonged um, strike uh, between the federal government and the unions within the Nigerian university system, uh, we could not be celebrating when the universities were on strike. Over 60 uh, participants who are going to give lectures, who are going to uh, give papers, specialized papers um, during that workshop, which will be on day two of um, the celebration. The event will have dignitaries like academics in attendance. Helen Osamede Akins, TVC News, Abuja.